Let, let me ask you something. Why are you calling me from different numbers? This is Stephanie. No, no, you listen. Why are you keep why do you keep calling me from strange numbers? Every like everybody's blocked. I've I've made it clear that I don't want to deal with the family. Can I explain that later? This is really an emergency. I know you hear all this noise in the background because we just had an emergency. What's what's the who is we? The family. So just thirty seconds to your time. So I am up here at the courthouse trying to settle stuff. So we were out and about. The cops came, saw Clarence, and I guess some kind of way they saw they. Anyway, so they picked him up basically and oh, took him to jail because good. of he had a warrant. And they said if you would drop the charges, because he facing life. This is his third strike. Listen. He facing life, and I'm, I don't want my daughters to be without their father. And this is like something so petty and so simple. If you just please, it's petty to who? Okay, let me say something because I don't want to interrupt you and be rude. First of all, you're not even supposed to be on the phone with me. Let me just say this in regards to Clarence. Clarence made threats against me. I didn't bother. I didn't bother. I'm not bothering nobody. I'm sitting here chilling, just relax in my humble abode. And he's coming at me about something he's totally wrong at, about. You want me to go pick up your daughters and you threatening me telling me what you're going to do. And you on probation? Okay, so now when you make the threats against me, I'm going to do what I need to do to protect myself. So now you coming back talking about what your daughter's need as far as your daughter's father should have knew that he was in jeopardy of going back to jail had he tried anything else that was against the law. So I don't feel obligated to come. So I, I come down and say what? And then, and then what, what am I supposed to say? Well, you, D, you know he's talking trash. You know. I don't know. I know this man was talking reckless to me. And when I say something, I mean it. So I don't know what he's going to do. So when you make threats against me, you should be smart enough to realize you're already on probation not to be making no threats against up, upstanding citizens, law-abiding citizens that pay their taxes like me. Man, I don't give a damn what Clarence do. I don't care what happened with him. I really don't. I'm not dropping nothing. I'm not dropping. I'm glad they picked him up. You can't be making no threats. You can't threaten me, man. I'm not bothering nobody. Now, when I do get up in arms and, 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 I, and I, I get triggered like this, I, I just, I prefer it out to be this way. So I just, in, I invoke the law. That's what I do. Oh, listen, I'm, I'm begging with you. I'm, I'm begging. So he's in jail right now? Yes, he is. How you doing? Okay. So, so I, I'm trying to figure out with this, with this incarceration, how am I supposed to help? How am I supposed to help the man that threatened to do something to me? What do you want me to do? No, no, you're going to leave me alone regardless. You're going to leave me. You know how he's going to leave me alone? He's locked up. He locked the whole family's going to leave me alone. And if anybody, I can't, I want the whole family, anybody that called me threatened, I want the whole family locked up, period. And I hate to be that way. I hate to. threaten you or mess with you. Going, going forward, this is it. We just go, Ashley got us involved. We done. We done with the whole situation. Okay. So, so let. Including him. Say what? Including him. Well, let me ask you, let me ask, let, all right, I want, I want to put this out and I want to put my cards face up so you can know exactly who you're dealing with and how I'm coming about this whole situation. Okay. You want me to go and say, uh, hey, listen, let's drop the charges. Uh, he really didn't threaten me um, when he actually did. Uh, let, let's, let's, let's show some compassion and some remorse to a dude that was talking big talk. He was talking big. He was you talking big. 